So we've got CRISPR and genetic engineering. So we now have the technology to genetically edit embryos, CRISPR, to select for intelligence, strength, or even personality traits. My question is, who gets to decide how humans are engineered? I think that's a valid question to ask. Then we have AI and automation creating a new cost system. You've got the AI and robotics that are rapidly replacing jobs, leading to a divided society where only the technological elite control knowledge and innovation. At least once a week, I really do try to just set the phone on the charger, leave it on D&D, try not to touch it. Can I just be honest and tell you how hard it is to do? Because I've been so sucked into this piece of technology for so long it's so difficult to do because everything runs off this for me I grew up in the 90s so I'm the last generation so to speak that we had cordless phones we had cd players you know we didn't have cell phones when I was in high school I carried around my parents big old Nokia that they well it wasn't big it was like you know but it was a big old fat brick phone and the other thing that's interesting um to this and it's funny because many of my friends and I've talked about this but that you know everyone has the attention span of a gnat right so short form content is specific to conditioning people so that we have no attention span, making it impossible to think critically or challenge authority. All of this is done by design. Right? And here we are. We all play along. We play the game because our society continues to move in that direction. 